welcome to the class in this class we will extend our discussion of questions relating to successive percentage increase and decrease with the help of this problem in the previous class uh, we have learned how to apply the concept of multiplying factor to solve these kind of uh, problems just to remind you that for these percentage these percentage increase these multiplying factors are applied and for these per percentage and similar to these percentage decreases these multiplying factors are applied uh, multiplying factors are basically a factor which has to be multiplied with the initial value to get the final value after certain per percentage increase or decrease we have discussed this in the part one of this class so let's uh, solve this question first read this question employees in a company first increased successively by 10 percent in two consecutive years and then decreases by 20 percent in the third year find the overall percentage increase or decrease in the employees in three years duration so uh, we have not given here the number of employees number of initial employees uh, but we are given just the percentage increase and decrease in uh, three uh, three years and we are uh, we have to calculate the overall percentage increase and decrease so uh, we have to assume some value on the basis of that we will do certain calculations in percentage if we assume a value as a multiple of 100 like 100x if we assume the value of 100x then it will be easier for for us to calculate any percentage increase or decrease so here we have assumed the value uh, of the number of employees as 100x this is the initial value initial value is 100x we have assumed so as given in the problem in the question uh, number of employees increased successively by 10% in two consecutive years that means in first year it is increased by 10% so if there is 10% increase in 100x then to get the value after 10% increase the suitable multiplying factor is 1.1 so after 10 percent increase the value becomes 110 x it is given in the problem that the 10 percent increase in two consecutive years that means in the second year also the increase is 10 percent again we have to multiply it with the suitable factor for 10 percent increase the factor is 1.1 so 110 x multiplied by 1.1 that is 121 x now uh, what is given that then it decreases by 20 percent in the third year third year there is a decrease third year the decrease of uh, 20 percent for 20 percent decrease the multiplying factor is 0.8 so to get the final value after 20 uh, percent decrease the previous value has to be multiplied with 0 0.8 so 121x into 0 0.8 is 8 ones are 8 then 8 to the uh, 16 6 8 ones are 8 and plus 1 8 to the 8 ones are 8 8 to the 16 then 8 ones are 8 plus 1 that is 9 we'll here put the decimal x so the final value is 96.8 x the initial value was 100 x final value is 96.8 x since the base is 100 we can directly tell we can directly tell with the help of uh, this initial and final value what is the percentage decrease so there is definitely a decrease and the percentage decrease can be get from subtracting this 
from this so 100 minus 96.8 that is 3.2 percent we will discuss more problem in the next class